And the Italians are in second place. Three teams left to skate. You hear the Russian crowd cheering on Bobrova and Soloviev, the six-time national ice dance champs from Russia, in second place after the short dance, one point behind the Shibatanis. sequence to start here. Very interesting skid they performed in unison right before they started. That's something I haven't seen before. strength from both of them. He was holding herself on his leg, but made it look easy. A very interesting interpretation to this music. You can see the, the characters they're playing, and she seems to um, be counting on him for, for strength. It, it seems that she can't see. Usually this music is, is used as a traditional Argentine tango. They've, they've taken it in a completely different direction. Katarina and Dimitri won the team gold in Sochi. They placed fifth in the ice dance competition. Ooh, oh. And a really difficult moment here during their spin. You can see a look of confusion from them on just how to try to save it. That is a, a big error that's going to cost them, especially how close they were to the Shibatanis. They really couldn't afford to make any mistakes. And not something that you see from this team that has been together for 17 years. And you can see it, the look on her face. Mm. Yeah, that's a, that's, a, that's a difficult moment. And 
you know, something that you just don't expect to happen when you need it to, when you need to skate perfect. 11th season on the Grand Prix, sixth appearance at Grand Prix Russia. They've won it three times. The defending champions back with their marks in a moment. Very interesting storyline to this program. A little bit difficult to decipher. They started with a very strong twizzle sequence here. I like the, the details, the, the hand gestures, the movements. It makes the, the, the story feel very alive. Sometimes you don't, you don't necessarily have to understand the story that they're telling to be able to appreciate the movements and, and the way it goes with the music. Here's one of the most spectacular lifts I, I've ever seen. Uh, he steadies her, but she's able to just balance herself on his yeah. leg. That, that is a, that's incredible. Unfortunately, he's, his knee is on the ice, so they're gonna be slowing down, and that's gonna take away a little bit from just how magnificent that. So here you can see there, her heel is hitting his skate. They're pulling away from each other a little bit too hard, trying to create speed during that spin, and you can see the, the look of just disappointment on the coach's face, Tatiana Tarasova there. recognizing that that their moment to to make a, a really strong impression here is has, has gone by the wayside unfortunately with that mistake and here at the end where she ducks out of his grasp and that's yeah that's that's difficult. They've, they've been together for a long time. They'll, they'll power through this, but this is an important season. You don't have a lot of opportunities to make the most of, of your programs, and you want momentum. You, you want to create a good buzz. You don't want questions surrounding yeah. Yeah, your that performances. Is below their season's best, even though it is early in the season. Again, they were just one point behind the Shibutanis. They had a comfortable five-point lead over third place, but uh, again, a mistake. And what'll be interesting is here in the the in Russia, the effect on the crowd will be noticeable. Having their top team not skate well, it'll be interesting to see how that affects the atmosphere of the event moving forward. And, and it's definitely something that can affect the competitors. 